Welcome, ladies and gentlemen. So what I'd like to do is show you how to multiply these two radical expressions. But before we go ahead and multiply, I want to make sure we can simplify them um, in, or write them in their simplest form. So here, um, 7 times square root of 32, I know that 32 is not a prime number. So I can rewrite this. I, what I want to do is try to rewrite this as the product of a squared number. And remember your squared numbers, you know 4, 9, 16, 25, 36, 49, blah, blah, blah. So keep on going on. So if I was going to go and simplify this, I would say, well, what is the largest square number that divides into 32? Because I can't, um, x is, uh, is going to be um, simplified. I can't break down x into any pairs of numbers. So, but 32, I can rewrite that as 7 times 16 times 2 times x. And the reason why it's nice to break up 32 into 16 times 2, because I know what the square root of 16 is. That is 4. So now I have 7 times 4 times 2x, which is 14 times the square root of 2x. So therefore, I have 14 times the square root of 2x. And then over here, well, 3 is a prime number, but y to the fifth power is not. And remember, we always want to take, just like how 16 is a squared number, y squared is a squared number. So to simplify this, I'll take this and say, all right, how, else, how, how many y squareds can I write for y to the fifth? Well, I can rewrite that as 3y squared times y squared times y to the first power. Because remember, when you multiply exponents, you add the powers. 2 plus 2 plus 1 is going to give you 5. Well, the square root of y squared is going to be y. The square root of another y squared is going to be y times 3 square root of 3y. So basically, what I'm multiplying is y squared times the square root of 3y. Now, when I multiply radical expressions, I multiply my numbers outside, and I multiply my at radicands. So 14 times y squared is 14y squared, times the square root of 2 times 3, which is 6, x times y, which is xy. So there you go, ladies and gentlemen. That is how you multiply two radical expressions. Thanks.